Here we go. Here we go. Let's do this. Volume. Oh, volume up, please. Thank you. <gasps> end of Ant-Man. Look. If you didn't know, end of credit scene. Do you remember me? Uh, your mom's name is Sarah. <laughs> your mom. Used to wear a newspaper and in your shoes. You're a wanted man. He's back. Look, he's back. I don't do that anymore. Well, the people who think you did are coming right now. They're not planning on taking you alive. Uh-oh. He wants to protect Bucky. That's why he is going against the government. Good angle. Jack Good angle. While a great many people see you as a hero... Hulk guy. ...some would prefer the word vigilant. Thunderbolt Ross. You've operated with unlimited power and no supervision. That's something the world can no longer tolerate. I know how much Bucky means to you. Stay out of this one. Please. It'll only make this worse. You saying you'll arrest me? There will be Please. consequences. Is it on the opposite team? Captain, you seem a little defensive. Well, it's been a long day. That black eye, though. If you can't accept limitations, we're not better than bad guys. That's not the way I see it. Sometimes I want to punch you in your perfect teeth. And he will. I just want to make sure we consider all our options. Because people that shoot at you usually wind up shooting at me too. Oh! Damn! Do you really want to punch your way out of this? What do we do? We fight. What? Ooh. Panther. Damn. I want some more of that. So obviously it's gonna be different than the comic books. In Civil War, it was the entire Marvel Universe, but this is more like more like a civil a civil battle. There's like 12 characters instead of 100. And I love how Black Panthers is kind of like, hey guys, I wanna join the party too. It's interesting because this is gonna be mainly about Steve wanting to protect Bucky. In the comics, it was all about protecting the actual American freedom and how America was kind of turning its back on that freedom. But this is more about friendship and how Tony used to be a friend and now he's gonna battle his friends. Interesting, very interesting. I'm surprised they didn't show Spider-Man in this trailer. But also not surprised because that would be a whole other trailer onto itself. I really hope this is the beginning of the Civil War story and not just tied up all in a bow in one movie. There's so much more to it, you know? Basically, I just want to see Spider-Man and his Iron Spider armor. I wonder if they're gonna do that in this movie. Alright guys, so let me know what you thought of the new Captain America Civil War trailer in the comments below. Also, are you Team Cap? or Teen Stark. As always, make sure you give this video a big thumbs up. Follow me on all my social media. Links are in the description below. And until next time, catch you cats on the flip-flop. Later!